Hey guys, IGFC 101 here, yeah, again, bringing you episode number 44 of my fo 43, sorry, of my Football Manager 2011 complete up down playthrough. And in this episode, this is the last episode of Football Manager 2011 with gameplay. So, um, get the tears out of the way at the beginning and um, let's get going. In the first match we played Hull, it took us a while to break them down until like the 70th minute. Um, but we managed to get the breakthrough. Um, I'm not even going to attempt to say t to try and say who scored because I really cannot see. It is literally impossible for me. But then once we got the first, we um, quickly got the second, and that put the game beyond doubt. It was a nice, nice, comfortable 2-0 home win against Tal. I can't remember how we did to them, how we did against them at KC, but it was a good win to get back on winning ways after the dis disappointing defeat against Middlesbrough. After that game, we went to QPR knowing that a win would pretty much seal it. It wasn't 100% sure, but it, we thought it would be, it'd pretty much guarantee a promotion place, which would be absolutely brilliant, of course. It was the whole point of this series. But we, I don't have the best record against QPR, and they hit us on the counter-attack um, in the first 10 minutes and took a 1-0 lead early on. Um, but I, I think we're the top scorer in the league, and I always have confidence in our scoring ability, so I wasn't really too worried. We had more than 80 minutes to go just to score one goal to get a point, which I'd have took from this game, even though they are on the, low, the lower end of the table. Um, so I was always confident of getting a goal, but then they did this to make it 2-0, and that's unfortunately how it stayed. So a disappointing 2-0 defeat at QPR, so we have to wait another week, or maybe even more, I don't know. But we'll see, but we couldn't get promotion against QPR, but maybe we can at Leeds. In this game, we knew if we won, we would be up because of other results we knew we would um, and we got for a pretty good start like 25 minutes um, they cleared it once but then we get the ball back in and um, we managed to tuck it home a great finish there I assume that's Ishmael Miller just by the finish but it could easily be someone else um, so that was a really good start and we thought the promotion dream is on I mean we win this we're up and so we got a good start and then when it got to this stage I was just trying to hold out for a for a nil, for a one nil win that would get us up, um, but um, I didn't go to defensive. I just stayed at attacking. But um, I don't know why that highlights now. I'm sorry. <laughs> but anyway, here we did make it two nil. Um, a good gut ball across and a tap in, and that sealed our promotion. So it's, I'm delighted to inform you guys that the whole season was a success. We did in fact achieve promotion from the championship. Um, as you can see here, I'll show you the news items. Um, Ipswich Town promoted so as an unexpected promotion, apparently. But I was absolutely delighted that I managed to get you a promotion. And you've seen every single goal of this series of a promotion winning season. You've seen all my transfers, all my tactics, everything. You've seen every game for like 38 games. So we went into the last game against Nottingham Forest. No, with nothing to play for, but we took an, we took an early lead. David Norris, I think, scored that one, if I remember rightly. And um, Nottingham Falls are in third place, um, so second v third. So this could have been a, such an interesting game if um, I hadn't already sealed promotion, but we had. So it's a shame, really. Well, it's not a shame, but you know what I mean. If it was a neutral, it would have been a shame. They managed to get equalised from another corner. We conceded a lot of goals from corners. I have no idea why that is. But... Um, so it could have been an interesting game, but it was just a dead rubber in the end because we'd already sealed promotion, so I wasn't too worried about the result. I didn't rest any players or anything because the last game of the season, just try and get a win. And luckily, that's what we did do. We ended the season on a high. Um, I think Lee Martin scored the final goal of the season, of the promotion-winning season, I might add. And that's it. That's all the goals. That's all 46 games. I'll be. This isn't the last episode. I'm going to do a review video showing all the tables, all the stats for all the country, all stuff like that. And that will be out soon. So hope you enjoyed all the gameplay that I've managed to get for you. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Later guys.